Hello everyone and welcome back to Pandor. Now we are currently at Sarleon as I was on my way to Ethos as it has come under attack once more by the forces of evil or should we say the Feards Vein. And who should I come across but Adonia here in this tavern. So hopefully we will welcome her back. Yes she has joined us and now we will speak to her and ask whether she wants to be her own woman, as it were, and hold a fief for us. Yes, here we go. Okay. Now, I only have very few to actually give. Hmm. I think we might need to change that in the upcoming sieges, perhaps. So I'm going to give her that one. There we are. And now she is a part of Cine Magni. Yes, okay, so that's very nice. Now we can level up our guys and head out to Ethos to defend it. I was currently on my way to Yavik's home to scout it out, and I saw a lot of units moving towards there, so I assumed they already knew I was coming and formed some sort of defense as a precursor to our invasion so hopefully that won't be there if we go back but I wouldn't hold out much hope considering it is the capital or it should be the capital of the Feards Vein and yes we have just lost it but that is fine because we are making our way back and we should intercept them and what are you doing lethal Get back there. Oh my goodness. He has 350 troops and he's still not <laughs> defending Ethos for whatever reason. Okay, well, yes, we're rejecting that. Okay, here we go. Now, ah, that's the guy. He's the marshal. I believe he led the forces against us. And here's this guy. He's an earl. Mm, he has 261 units. This guy has 76. Okay, that's not too bad. Yes, he's running into Ethos. Yes, I expected that. Oh my goodness, okay, only 35 troops. 71 from the vassal himself. Who's this? Farmers against forest bandits. Oh, well, they lost already, damn it. Uh, I don't think that is worth my time very much, though, so... Oh, maybe I can catch this guy. I really want to be able to catch this guy. He has the majority of troops. 1.9, 2.3... We were in the trees though. 2.7? 2.3. Yes, we can catch him. Let's do it. Oh yeah. Okay, he used to be the Lord of Senderfall. So, we will hopefully keep that while we defeat him in battle. Mortal Kombat. Oh yes, here we go. Okay, renown value is 20. And no battle advantage whatsoever, so he's either got some very high level units or we are completely outclassed. Either way, we are not looking good. Okay, now, I am not used to the speed of this horse. I have not visited Pendor for quite some time. <laughs> Just been too busy with my recovery and, of course, the other series I've been recording. Now... Where are they? We must take them by force very swiftly. Oh no, this is not good. Okay. They have the high ground by the looks of things. Although our Noldor are doing an excellent job of picking them off and so am I. Yeah! 8.5 shot difficulty. That's what I like to see. Come on, take that guy down. What should I say? Girl. It is a girl, right? Otherwise, I'm insulting him. <laughs> uh, yeah, I believe it was. Okay, I think we should charge. All oh, the cavalry seem to already charge. Okay. And I'm getting charged as well, by the looks of things. Oh, no. Pole arms in the face. That is not very pleasant of them. And these are light infantry. Thank goodness they're not berserkers. Fully fledged just yet. 
Ow. Okay. I got stopped by something. Impressive. Heavy archer, how dare you. Okay. Come on. Oh my goodness. I am so out of practice with this sword. Come on, guys. Why aren't they charging? Are they all archers, these guys? <laughs> I think they are, actually. Oh my. I might need to reformulate my army a bit. Even though we are decimating their forces, which is always nice to see, I must say. 66 enemies remaining. Yeah, come on. Take him down. Oh, take her down, should I say. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm insulting everyone. Left and right. Well, we are at war. What can they expect? They declared it on us first. And we were just a small kingdom at the time. We only had a few fiefs that belonged to us. And now we own half the map. I will actually show everyone that afterwards because I looked at it just before I started recording and I just thought to myself, wow, it was like an age ago that we started out as one of the Feared's Vein became a vassal and fought the Three Seers, I believe, if you can remember that. That was quite a long time ago, actually. <laughs> ah, amazing fight. The Feared's Vein army versus the Three Seers. And I th believe the Three Seers had, I think it was 1,200 units or something. Really, really immense army. And the Feared's Vein, at first, had, I believe it was 400 or 500. I was sitting on an army of 80, I believe, or 100. Maybe not even that. I might be over-exaggerating that a little bit, but... Yeah, it was just absolutely amazing to engage them in battle because to begin with, the game gives you an option whether you want to side with the <laughs> side with the three seers or side with the Feared's Vein and I was so so tempted to select the three seers as I just wondered what would happen if you were friendly with them. You could just help them run around the countryside utterly decimating everything in your path. And I just thought, oh yeah, that would be amazing, you know. Play the evil one for once, you know. And yeah, that didn't really work out. I did select the Feared's Vein. I chickened out because I believed the Feared's Vein would have a lot more units when it came to it. And it was the right call to make. So... Yeah, the Three Seers eventually lost, I believe, even though I was knocked out of the fighting due to my complete ineptness at maneuvering my horse at that time. Yes, at that time. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm still pretty bad, but I've gotten a little bit better, I'd like to think. <laughs> uh, perhaps. Okay, we have 116, and the enemy has 58. So, they're not looking good. We have taken out most of their main force, so I don't think they're going to be around for much longer. Yeah. Okay. Oh, they have quite a bit of cavalry still as well. That's not very nice. Let's take them down, guys. Come on. Charge them. Ow. Oh my god. Goodness, what was that? That was some sort of beast unit there. Really? Whoa. Okay, I think it was a... Oh, I see, yes. It was a Jatu Battle Rider, I believe. Oh my, okay. We need to get a few more of those, perhaps. <laughs> Maybe we could fight... What could we fight to get Jatu Battle Riders? Because I don't think Jatu fight Jatu, so we couldn't go to the Jatu land. So I suppose what we could do is take them prisoner and then try to convert them but I haven't had great success with converting people in my past attempts at least so that might not be the most accurate way of procuring 
any Jatu battle riders. But I think we have a pretty solid army as it is. Oh, there we go. Take out that guy. Or it could have been an adventurer, actually. Hero adventurer, perhaps. They're quite tough to take down. And there we are. I believe that is the battle. Oh, yes. Okay, wow. Oh, we get to take him prisoner. Nice.